If that celestial is incapable of delivering the final judgment your children deserve, Doom shall take matters into his own hands. Clearly, no other being is worthy of such vast cosmic power. Thus, Doom must transcend his mortal flesh. And become a god himself. This was Doom's destiny! Yeah, well my destiny was to be a supermodel. Life don't always go as planned, Doomsy. Even so, life is always precious. Especially the lives of those we've sworn to protect. A lesson you'd be wise to remember, now that your subjects have their souls back, Victor. Our pals from S.H.I.E.L.D. are inbound. We'll get his royal pain into custody and... I'm afraid I can't let you do that, Tony. Not yet. Reed, uh, what are you... When we were all in Doom's lab earlier, I noticed some troubling data on his scanners. Of all the freaky things in that lab, you picked the data? Classic Reed. The power signatures being recorded were so intense that even Doom's instruments couldn't accurately decipher them. I fear that your recent encounter with Thanos and the Infinity Stones may have reawakened ancient cosmic forces, and they might be... Headed here, to Earth. Doom felt them too. They have witnessed our power and they seek to restore the cosmic balance by removing us from the equation. But fear not. Doom shall lead your pathetic assemblage of heroes to glorious victory against them. Hard pass, but thanks anyway. Yeah, I'm with Torch. You know Doom can't ever be trusted. But his motivations to protect Latveria, in his own twisted way, have always been clear. And if Victor is concerned enough to consider joining our alliance, then the threat must be even more serious than I anticipated. We may have survived this battle, but a much bigger one is on the horizon. And there's only one way to survive it. Together. <laughs>